gentlemen welcome back hope you're all doing well and for the last time at least for a while this is the only time i'm going to be able to say this for a bit but we're back with some more re-zero man we have the season two finale today honestly i'm just ready to get into this man you know what a journey re-zero season two has been bro like goddamn like i still remember the first episode of season two like it was yesterday bro like i just can't believe we're already here at the finale of season two i don't know if you know they see the popularity of re-zero that they're like yo they they want to make a season three right away or we're gonna have to wait like four more years or of course i'm sad to see it go but at the same time i'm also really excited to see the future of re-zero after this arc man i'm really excited to see exactly how they wrap up this season because goddamn, bro like the moments in this season were spectacular the last episode the moment with beatrice and subaru god damn i i still cannot get that scene out of my head bro that has to like i said top two top three best scenes ever in re-zero bro like i absolutely love this episode and there's probably gonna be better you know or you know moments as great as that in the future you know in the next coming arcs but of course whenever we get those arcs is kind of the you know the question to be answered but regardless guys I just gotta give everyone a huge thank you so much for you know sticking with your boy um along with re-zero bro i know re-zero uh isn't the most popular series on my channel but of course you know i still love watching with you guys i still love experiencing this and you know regardless of how well it does or you know whatever the fuck you want to say about it i love this series and thank you so much for everybody that watches with me right now and love this series along with me you guys are the true mvps man but other than that everybody I'm ready to get into this. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and hit that bell, guys. It's super easy. It takes like one second. Of course, you guys can always change your mind later. Also, make sure to click that like button. It really helps about a lot. But nonetheless, let's get it. All right. So that meant Subaru and Beatrice is here to help right now. We about to take out these rabbits right here. Oh my God, dude. This, this Subaru is the goat, bro. It just started. Oh yeah, Rom. I, I'm pretty sure Rom will be fine though. Yeah, Beatrice. Yeah, yeah, exactly. We got to get our head in the game right now. There's a fuck ton of man-eating rabbits right here. We got to do this. <laughs> Beatrice saying Subaru. <laughs> Yo, Beatrice is adorable, bro. I love her. I mean, Beatrice, I mean, we seem pretty confident right now. I mean, we got it like that. I mean, shit, I'm, I'm ready to see. Hey, yo, Beatrice? Okay. That's what I like to hear. That's what I like to hear, Subaru. Let's go. Exactly, bro. The development going crazy on my man. All right, let's do, let's do this, bro. Fuck these rabbits. God damn, Beatrice. Okay. God, sheesh. Damn, we took out a fuck ton of them already. Exactly. Yeah, Subaru's like, okay, so what am I supposed to do? She's like, just hold my hand. That's all you got to do, bro. Oh, shit. Okay, so Super is actually helping. That's dope. Dog, these rabbits really ain't shit. The, the white whale put up a much, much harder fight than these. Yo, don't worry. Subaru is really good at acting as a decoy. We got this. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, bro, he's flexing. Like, bro, I'm always the bait for the strong ass enemies, dude. You can trust me. Dude, the confidence, man, in, in Subaru is going crazy. It's actually insane, like, just how far everyone's come, dude. I, just, I, I, I know I keep saying that, but, like, it's honestly like, like astounding and look at this teamwork right here so we trapped all of them in here we about to take them all out great spirit beatrice okay the flex shamak okay, i like that i like that the shamak what the fuck they're eating each other uh that's actually kind of they expect them to get taken out like that it's kind of gruesome damn so that's how they get taken out huh dare i say it was a little bit easier than i thought it would be but honestly beatrice she's fucking overpowered dude sheesh and this man roswell getting tears all over rom yeah we need that smile bro we need that smile beatrice thank you beatrice thank you oddly wholesome start after you know the rabbits kind of devouring each other oddly wholesome start but i really like that a lot damn no opening at all either damn they really how many times did they show the opening for this part it has to be like only like three times three or four times right nope subaru is not that person okay well roswell he seems he seems all right right now he doesn't seem as mind broken as before and he said she said i want to make subaru my number one that's why i left the library roswell wait you mean that roswell yeah okay so that's what i'm yeah okay 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 i understand i understand so he's that Ro okay yeah i get it i get it i get it oh beatrice damn god damn beatrice just a little love tap no problem with that yeah roswell yeah 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 i'm sorry about that you, you, your whole mansion burnt down uh you know you know you gotta stop with the sentimental stuff bro that shit gets me hella emotional 
That's nice though. I'm glad to see that Roswell is still, you know, I guess like intertwined with the group. I was really afraid that they were gonna like somehow kill him off or, or make him like a villain or villain or something like that. Oh, oh hey, Echidna. Why does she look kind of sweet, different? Echidna? She does look a little different, like her nose and stuff like that. Wait, wait. So now I might, my, now I might just be blowing this out of proportion. That could have obviously been just like a stylistic change they did for that scene right there. But that echidna does not look like the echidna that I've seen. Like that one kind of has like a nose actually. Her face is a little bit more like slimmer, I guess like that. Like it's just a different shape. So i don't understand i don't get that i understand the roswell thing but i don't understand why how come we or i guess subaru and amelia they see a different echidna well the, the thing 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 is that in roswell's backstory they never show showed echidna's face and i even pointed that out before i'm like okay maybe it's like a cinematic thing but like maybe why is that why does echidna look like that because because that's what I was saying. Like, even Amelia, when she looked at Echidna, she was like, oh, this is supposed to be Echidna's, you know, where she was buried. Who is this? I'm like, what the fuck? I'm like, she has the same clothes, Amelia. She has the same hair. I'm like, what do you mean? How do you not know that's not Echidna? But at the same time, that doesn't look like Echidna. What's going on here, man? What, what What's going on here? Okay. Hold on. See, like, this is what I'm saying, bro. This is what I'm saying. This is like... There's some shit that I mean they might answer right now, but okay, let me let, let let's continue. Let's continue. I'll, I'll I'll formulate the theories in my head as we go. Still got our wholesome time right now. We're finally done with all this hard work, hopefully. I don't want to see no more suffering. Hey, you changed too, Subaru. We've all changed, honestly. Amelia, why are you getting embarrassed? What's wrong? Oh shit, it's time. It's time. Yes. Yes, Subaru loves your ass. Yes, yes, yes. Get that into our head right now. We we need to see this. Oh my god, the anticipation. The, wait! Wait, what? Wait, what? Amelia? The. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way. I. I'm a little. Wait. Maybe, when could she have, and with who? I mean, Subaru, but there's no, no, there's, there has been no time. I'm sorry, I'm a little speechless right now. Amelia, what? She said, the, we need to talk. I know you say you love me, but I got this baby in my belt. What? Let's continue, let's continue. What the fuck are you talking about? Pardon, yes, pardon, excuse me? You can't just say like, yo, I'm pregnant. What the fuck? The father? What the fuck? Okay, Subaru. Okay, okay. This has to be some to some sort of meme because even Subaru doesn't know what the fuck he she's talking about. Oh my god. Oh, it's because she's so innocent. Oh my god. It's just because she's so. It's because she's so pure. Oh puck, puck, bitch ass. Yo, I was so confused. I was. I. God damn. Okay, Garfield. Punch the shit out of Roswell. Okay, I'm sorry. I gotta pause again real quick. I gotta pause real quick. I was just, I, guys, I was, I'm sorry. I was so confused. I'm like, I was just thinking of like, there's no fucking way that she's actually pregnant. What? Can you imagine? You can't drop something that big in the last episode, bro, and expect me to wait like a couple fucking years to see what happens. Okay, I, I was like, th th this has to be a meme. Subaru himself, he doesn't even know what the hell she's talking about. I'm like, oh, it's because she's innocent. You know, when the boy and a girl kiss, she thinks that they have a baby. Okay. Okay, Amelia. Okay, that's fine. It's, it's a little wholesome, but that fucking scared the shit out of me. I'm not going to lie. God damn. Okay, they all get a hit on, on Ross. Even Otto, bitch. Okay. And it's not that bad, Ross. That's cool. God damn, Ram, like, Ram is still simping for Roswell. Damn, I forgot about... Yo, yo, I forgot Garfield actually liked Rom, so... Yeah, I mean, Garfield seems fine with it, though. I am glad to hear this. Like I said before, I'm happy that, you know, they're they're able to forgive Roswell in a way and that he's still integral to, um, the, you know, the, ma the main story and shit like that. Because I still like him. He's, he's, he's such an interesting character. Roswell? Hello? Man's taking off his bandages? Yo? Okay, he got the crest. So he's actually, like, binded that he can't hurt any of... Uh, any of them damn okay that's pretty convincing Roz. i mean it seems pretty good to me that man literally just cannot betray us at all 
I'm sorry, I cannot take her off seriously with his fucking swollen ass cheeks. God damn, Petra. Well, I guess, you know, that's not... You know, I, I guess that's fine. Petra doesn't have to forgive. Well, actually, I'm actually really glad that they, 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 they didn't all fully forgive him. Because I feel like that would have been too easy. What is it? Said, said he's sorry? Or like what? Like, like... Formally apologize? <laughs> wow, I did not. Yo, Amelia really is like an innocent ass soul. All, all, all Amelia wants is like, Roswell, just say you're sorry. That's fine. That's how you end it. Gomenasai. I'm sorry. Forgive me. Damn, that man said it properly as fuck too. Gomenasai. Damn, okay. I forgive you too, Roswell. Don't worry. I still like you. I still like your ass. Even though you were, you know, really, really fucked up in some parts. I still like you. Damn, so we, all we gotta do right now is just, we gotta save Rem. We gotta, you know, find that boy Gluttony. You know, that man, uh, Regulus is still out there. Oh, that's kind of cute. Okay, they got Rem here. That's dope. Yeah, we really dressed up and everything. We really having the... Oh, the drip! Okay, and we got the sword on deck. Yo. Yo, hold on. I'm sorry. Subaru, that drip is looking... That drip is looking clean. See, interesting how Subaru doesn't call her echidna either I, mean, I wonder if that's the last time we're ever gonna see echidna then you know i mean the last thing we saw her do was cry with amelia hey okay amelia she looking proper as hell too i like it i like it everyone's drippy right now dude yo my man super about to become a knight yo hold on we're in the praise of the wishes disciple but you win for today roswell you sly ass bastard okay i see you bro damn this is kind of interesting that he's getting knighted right now because as we know beforehand Subaru was like, I remember like when he first went to the Capitol and he met Julius and whatnot, he was like, yo, and he had this whole, you know, argument in the, in, when, when uh, Amelia was there for the royal selection and stuff like that with the candidates, right? Subaru had this whole ass tantrum, like how like, yo, what's so good about being a knight anyway, bruh? And like, you know, he had this, all this shit and you know, it's kind of strange right now to see him like, this is growth right here. This is growth. That man is being knighted right now. That man about to be in standing with that boy Reinhardt, that boy Julius. That's kind of cool, dude. I'm not going to lie. That's really cool. Like, yo, the, the knight get up, that shit is suiting Subaru a lot. I really like that a lot, man. I'm really happy for my boy. I I'm glad that... I'm glad that things are starting to go right right now. You know, things are starting to go right. Happy times. But... I always say, you know, I forget. I'm watching ReZero right now. I know that these happy times do not last forever. I just know. Don't get me wrong. I remember the goddamn third trial with Amelia. We saw Amelia standing with like all this destruction around. There was blood on her face. She was like, I hate you. There was a bunch of crazy shit that was happening in there that was foreshadowing events that's supposed to happen in the future. So don't worry. Don't get me wrong. <clears throat> I assume that this happy stuff is not going to last for that long. But A, for the time that it's here. Your boy's about to enjoy it. All right. Yo, we looking clean right now, dude. We about to get knighted. Super, do we even know how to use that sword, though? Like, come on now. Damn, dude. <laughs> yo, Frederica crying over here. Yo. That man auto drift up. Yo, Roswell. Oh, okay, okay. I like that. Ah, the flashback to your mom and dad. Ooh, my father and mother. Real ones right there. I like that. I like that. That's some real shit. <laughs> Hard hard bro this shit is too hard right now yours and yours alone we've came we've come so far bro we've come so far my man subaru prospering amelia she prospering shit is going good okay Subaru, come on now we, we, we at the commencement ceremony right now <laughs> that man gotta slide in gotta slide in the mat game real quick like by the way you looking kind of sexy I I feel you on that. Okay. I mean, shit, it's about time that man Subaru got some new rags, bro. That man been wearing the goddamn tracksuit for 10 bajillion years. I, don't, I know that man got the butler costume and shit, but like, goddamn, that was it. Finally, he got some new drip. Do my night later. I love you too. That's gonna be it, bro. I'm calling it right now. I love you too. Peaky promise, promise as well. It's over. It's over. Super, we're in. To my room. It's over. It's over. GG's. GG's. We've won. We've beat the game. We've beat the game. It's over. I wouldn't even be mad. I wouldn't even be mad if this is how ReZero ever ends. Just happy times. But I know that's not the case. This better not end on no fucked up stuff too. On, on some like fucked up cliffhanger. I'm about to be. Oh, I'm about to be pissed. This man Subaru is whipped, bruh. I agree with that. Doesn't matter. Beginning in the middle don't matter. All that matters is the end, bruh. Real talk. And this is where we are now. And that's all that matters. Ooh. These shots, though. Okay. Glistening. 
We glistening right now, okay? God damn, get you a man's like Subaru. This boy Subaru is the goat. I don't care what anybody says. I don't give a fuck what anybody says. You can't change my mind. This boy Subaru is the motherfucking goat. That is so cute that like, they're still trying to like, you know, like Rem is here. That's really dope. I like that. Oh yeah, we about to dance, huh? I was about to say like, bro, why aren't we dancing right? This is, this is, we've won. We've won. We're dancing with Amelia. We're at night now. We got the drip. We looking nice. We looking good. Bro, we've won. Happiness, smiling, offbeat steps under the... You gotta play the opening though, really? Why is this so happy? There has to be... There's gonna be a director's cut of season two. And they're about to show some fucked up stuff at the... This is exactly how season one ended too. Season one ended. We're like, yeah, we're happy and stuff like that. We're smiling and everything. Season two is gonna be the exact same thing. They're gonna show a director's cut. They're gonna have a cliffhanger at the very end like they did. With, with the season one director's cut, it's gonna be over, dude. I can't accept this. I can't accept this happiness right now because I know when the fucked up stuff starts going on, I'm about to be shattered. My dreams, I want everyone to be happy. I want this. I wish this could be our ideal reality with everybody. That everyone is happy as fuck, chilling, prospering, thriving all together. Happy family, right? But I just know that's not the case. I know what I'm watching, dude. This is dope. Though. I like this. I'm glad that they played the opening too because I really like this opening too. I really do. And they only, like I said, I, I believe they only played it like three or four times throughout the entire season two, part two. So that's cool. That is just so cute to see them dancing together, man. I just, I love that shit, dude. Oh, this anime, bro, is so good. That's really gonna be it though, huh? Damn, you really gonna end on this happy ass scene of them dancing together, huh? Okay. White Fox, I see you guys. I see you, man. Okay, well, first of all, before I even talk about anything else, season, ReZero season two, what would I give it out of 10? Fucking 15, bro. God damn, I still stand by the fact that I think ReZero is one of the best, if not the best, I guess, serious isekai that I've seen because one of my other favorite isekais is Konosuba, but that's more of like a comedy parody. parody. But like, if I'm talking about like an isekai, where like it kind of is like a serious plot line and shit like that. I, I would definitely say that ReZero probably stands above all. In my personal opinion, dude. I fucking love this show a lot. You know, like, and the thing is like, I'm not that big into isekais in general, bro. Like there's only a few that like I really enjoy. And I just think ReZero to not only be an isekai, but to be one of my favorite animes overall, it takes a lot, bro. And like season two, I felt like they, they went off, bro. They went off in season two. I thought season two part one was like peak the fucking parent and child episode when Subaru met his parents again and he had this closure the one where he was ranting to Echidna about how he can return by death he can finally talk about it the whole thing with the witches he made against Satella again I thought that was like yo this is peak ReZero there's no way it gets better season two part two was kind of like the redemption arc bro this time for us to win and this was the payoff right here throughout all the pain and the agony this was the payoff that us fans got we get to see our characters happy. That's all we want, just for them to be happy. Even though I do, even though it sounds fucked up, I do like when the, when, when, when you know, when, when the death and stuff happens, because obviously I feel like that is a main attraction of ReZero, even though part of me doesn't want it to happen, part of me does want it to happen, but I love, I love them being happy. Trust me, I do love it. But like I said, ReZero season two, fucking 100 out of 10 bro i fucking loved re-zero i definitely definitely think they um build build it up they built upon what they established in season one and made it a lot better in terms of the intensity like these consistent 30 minute episodes not them not showing the opening at all dude like i love that bro like it just shows that like they are so committed to showing us like the just quality man all around and i absolutely love that dude um in terms of like my, I guess my thoughts going forward, there's nothing really I can think of except us trying to take out, um, you know, um, um, Gluttony and Regulus wherever they are, man. You know, obviously we got to get Rem back, you know, from her coma and whatnot. Um, Pandora, I don't know where she's doing in the present timeline. Obviously, she's probably still an issue somewhere. So Pandora. Like I said, guys, I, I don't um, read the, the light novel for ReZero. So like I said, I'm going in totally blind with everything. So like, I don't really know. All I know, I guess, 
and it, like clues is Amelia Star trial when she was heard hearing all the voices in her head they were saying some kind of some fucked up stuff bro you know like they were saying like they hate each other you know Amelia was covered in blood everything was destroyed so you know like I, there's probably gonna still there's gonna be some you know serious ass you know dark moments coming forward in the future but um t t for what that leads up to those moments i have no clue i guess we have to wait and because i'm wondering um if i'm gonna read ahead right now or whatever like no i'm not gonna read ahead i'm not gonna read the light novel going forward i am gonna wait until a season three gets announced that's usually what i do for animes that i've kind of started i rarely like rarely rarely go to the source material if the material hasn't been adapted like i don't know it just feels weird for me switching to the anime to the light novel that's just how i roll though so uh, i'm gonna stick anime only dude but uh, i feel like that's just i don't know i like i like experiencing rezero that way but um that's about it guys man i i love this show man thank you guys so much once again man for sticking with me um when i ever i started rezero last rezero season two last year bro uh, it's been quite the journey quite the journey dude we got to see all these characters go through a lot of trials and tribulations through this time and uh got to meet a lot of new characters gotta say goodbye to a couple men like i said i don't really know if echidna is gonna make a reappearance again um i don't know if she's gonna have any more i guess integral uh you know i guess like uh meaning to the plot anymore since we're kind of done with the sanctuary and stuff like that uh i don't know if we're gonna see like satella and the other witches but i hope we do though i hope we do they're like really interesting i really hope that we see them again but like i said guys i guess we gotta wait until season three man but uh, once again, everybody, thank you so much for all the love and support on the ReZero video so far. Um, this was the last time that we're going to watch ReZero together for a while. So kind of a meaningful goodbye. But I guess it's it's great that we leave it on a good note, man. But I do, I do know, trust me, I do know that if they have a director's cut, the first thing that I'm going to do, the first thing that I am going to do, I am going to see if there's an ending scene. Because I know damn well, I know damn well there's got to be something, bro. Because they did the same thing that they did with season one in that director's cut. But other than that, everybody, I hope you have a great ass day today, man. I love y'all. Thank you so much for watching ReZero with me. You guys are the real ones. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, guys. And hit that bell. Super easy. It takes like one second. Of course, you guys can always change your mind later. Also, make sure to click that like button before you head out. It really helps the boy a lot. But nonetheless, it's Benny Boy Ivory. And I'm out. Peace. Mm -hmm.